forecast that's independently certified most accurate. Here's meteorologist Eric Zarnix. Well, that rain really came down last night, but now things are starting to dry out as our system heads eastward. And again, we just stay with the clouds, at least for now. By tomorrow morning, we should start to see a little bit of sunshine. As far as rainfall totals go, areas to the west of Cincinnati saw the highest amounts, between about an inch to an inch and a half, all the way from Brookville down through Hamilton, the west side of Cincinnati, Florence, and Vivi. To the east side, that's where we had about a half inch to an inch. So West Union, Georgetown, Hillsborough, and Falmouth all seeing Again, a good douse of rain, but the heaviest just to the west of town. Temperature right now, 40 degrees. Our winds blowing out of the north at 13 miles an hour. Those northerly winds have dropped their temperatures all day long. Our high was 57 degrees just after midnight, but this afternoon, we've been sitting at 40 degrees pretty much all afternoon and evening long. With those winds out of the north at 13 miles an hour, it feels more like 33 degrees out there. So dress warmly if you plan on heading out. For sales, 40 degrees, VV, 41 degrees, 39 in Peebles, 38 degrees in Hillsboro, and 40 degrees in Mount Orb. So we're all dealing with this cloudy, cool, and damp weather. Now, as far as our weather maker goes, it's moved off to the east. Plenty of rain for New York City, snow once you get to the north of Boston and up towards Bangor, Maine. For us, high pressure is dropping down, and that's going to eventually clear out our skies. In fact, you can start to see a little bit of that clearing happening across northern Indiana and northern Ohio. That reaches us late tonight. And and early tomorrow morning, but it doesn't last long. You can see all these clouds in the central plains. They'll still start to build in by Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. Right now, Monday is looking like a pretty cloudy day. As far as the Bengals game goes tomorrow, yeah, sunny skies, but the temperatures will stay cool. 38 for your tailgate, 41 degrees for kickoff, and our high tomorrow afternoon only 43 degrees. So it is going to be a cool day. But hey, at least we have a little sunshine, right? Tomorrow morning, we'll start off with a few clouds, easily breaking out into some sun by 9:10. O'clock and temperatures topping out at 43 during the afternoon. During the evening hours, that's when we start to see a few more clouds build in, and those clouds will continue to thicken pretty much overnight, Sunday into Monday. And it looks like those clouds will hang around the majority of the day on Monday, even Tuesday and Wednesday. So, future cast showing clouds clearing tonight. Tomorrow morning, some sunshine during the afternoon hours. Our first sign of our next system building in from the west, filtered sunshine by sunset, and then those clouds continue to build in. And on Monday, the chance for some showers, overcast skies, and that's when we start to see a nor'easter take shape for the east coast. We're going to be on the back side of things, so not much happening in the Ohio Valley, but we will see some snow flurries and some snow showers by Tuesday. Tonight, 28 degrees, late clearing and colder. Tomorrow, we'll make it up to a high of 43, and your seven-day forecast shows much cooler weather as we head into Monday and Tuesday with highs in the upper 30s, morning lows back in the 20s, but we have a nice warming trend headed this way, and you'll feel it by next Thursday, Friday, and Saturday.